What's up, movie crew? So today is Tuesday. You know what that means. It's new release Tuesday. All right, so I'm going to be honest with everyone. I only know of, like, five titles coming out today. I know Invasion of the Body Snatchers is getting a 4K. I know we got that new T2 Steel book. And we've got those three Criterion 4Ks. Right now, I am in front of Best Buy. I'm going to go in there. I'm going to look around. I'm also going to check out their early Black Friday deals. If you saw last week's video, then you already know a little something for those that do not, that did not see it. One, I will have a pinned comment down below where you can watch last week's new release video. But for those that don't know, my local Best Buy is right next door to my local Barnes & Noble. So I'm going to go into Best Buy, I'm going to check some stuff out, see what they got. And then I'm going to head over to Barnes & Noble where they've got that Criterion sale. This particular week though, Citizen Kane, Uncut Gems, Menace to Society are all being released on 4K Criterion. Now I am a little uncertain of what to expect. I did come over here last week thinking I was going to get Mulholland Drive. And that didn't happen. So let's check this out and see what they got. All right, y'all, first stop of the day is Best Buy. Let's go in there and see what they got. All right, so we got Hacksaw Ridge. We got the time I got reincarnated as a slime, season one, okay? We've got Batman Year One, or I picked that up, Candyman. Got that brand steel book. We got respect, reminiscence, all of the G.I. Joe, Injustice, more steel books. So I got that Snyder Kite. And Space Jam. Got a copy of Protege. Got that Jungle Cruise steel book that I showed off last week. Looks like we've also got some copies of Hitman's Bodyguard and Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard. And we got some copies of Free Guy. Let's head to the back. All right, so I am just now leaving Best Buy. They did not have the Terminator Steelbook, for anyone wondering. It was supposed to go next to Hacksaw Ridge, and they didn't get any. I uh, kind of made friends with a couple of people here, and they told me that not only do they not have any, they never got any in. In all honesty, I wasn't going to buy it because I do have the Total Recall T2 Steelbook combo pack that was released from Target a while back. And not as huge in the Terminator as some of the other people that do these videos. Just my personal opinion. I do apologize for not showing the stuff in the back at my local Best Buy. That's where the sound systems are also at. And there were people checking out music or listening to the music through the sound systems and they were blaring it so I could not really record without it without this hearing the music so I do apologize for that but now we are going to go into Barnes and Noble and see if they got them criterions all right so I just left Barnes and Noble I've got good news and I got bad news and something where I'm not sure how to feel the good news, I did pick up something. The bad news, I went to go see which criterions they had. I go up to the help area and I just said the word citizen. And the person told me we haven't gotten them. The first disc is defective, which means when we get them, we have to send them back. 
I don't know who all watches my videos first, but if you're watching mine before you watch other Bluetubers, if you're looking for Citizen Kane, apparently the disc is messed up. Here's the eh news. I did ask about the other new Criteria movies that came out. Again, she said when with Citizen Kane, none of the new Criterions came in here. One of those is available at my next closest Barnes & Noble. Here's the thing, it's an hour away. As of right now, I have picked up one title, and for those that missed my most recent unboxing video, I'm going to show that off again. So, it looks like I'm going to go over there. I don't know what else to say on that one. So, I am going to hit up the second closest Barnes & Noble for some other Criterions. All right, it is time to show everyone what I picked up on New Release Tuesday. All right, so the first thing I got was in my unboxing video. There's going to be a uh, pinned comment down below for anyone that wants to check that out. I got Krampus, the Naughty Cut, two weeks early. If you want to see everything that's included with this, including the poster, then check out the pinned comment down below where I do a full-on unboxing for this and show off the poster. But yes, I am very much looking forward to finally getting my hands on the naughty cut of Krampus. All right, so the first trip to Barnes & Noble, I picked up Mulholland Drive on 4k last week my local barnes and noble did not have it but there is the 4k disc there is the booklet and there is the blu-ray disc so i was finally able to get my hands on this Next, we've got Uncut Gems on 4K. So I bought the Blu-ray for this that A24 released a while back. I thought it was a good movie. But truth be told, main reason I want to pick this up is so I could show some support for Criterion doing 4K, for A24 doing more 4Ks, because at the moment... I own Ex Machina, and there's another one that I have not yet revealed, and I won't be revealing it until the Black Friday video. But we do have a little bit of disc artwork with Uncut Gems. There is the 4K. There is the Blu-ray. And we got a little booklet with this one as well, because it is Criterion, so of course there are booklets. I gotta say, I like this. Looks really nice. And even on the inside, you got it where it looks like a jewelry catalog. Oh. And we got a little bit of... Artwork for the Digibook. Apologies for the random silence. I had a bunch of people walking by. Next, you've probably noticed a little theme here. Menace to Society on 4K. And this one's a, more of a fold-out thing than a booklet. And it does look like the Blu-ray and the 4K have the same disc artwork. All 
All right, so when I went to my first Barnes & Noble, I mentioned that the second I said the word citizen, the person at the counter informed me they didn't get them and that they were already on recall. So I got to this one where they gave me a thing where I can do the disc replacement program. I will also include some pictures at the end that I got from Geek Gab News Instagram profile. If you're on Instagram, go give Geek, Geek Gab News a follow. That is where I keep updated on stuff. So, I am going to show off the Digibook, though. We got K, and there's a 4K disc. Then you got A, and then you got the second Blu-ray disc, the first Blu-ray disc, and... Then you got the first set of bonus features, and then E, and you got the last set of bonus features. On top of that, you got the booklet. And let me get this. All right, we got it. And this one is a slip, which is something I'm not used to from Criterion. And it goes into the slip. But that's going to do it for this one. If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. You like what you see? Leave a thumbs up. Comment down below what did you pick up on New Release Tuesday? Did you get your hands on some Criterions? Did you get your hands on that T2 Steel book? But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching and tune in next time. All right, now that this hunt is over, time for some food.